Thank you for coming back to my channel for your stimulus check and stimulus package update. Please subscribe to my channel. Please leave your thumbs up and please leave your comments. First of all, I want to say thank you so much for all the support that you give me on this channel. I really do appreciate you for it. Thank you so much. Bitcoin, WhatsApp, cryptocurrency of any kind. If you see any of that garbage in my comments with my name and a picture of me, please know that is not me. That is a scammer. Please do not fall for that garbage and please do not call them phone numbers. We the people. If you want your comments put over on the We the People website, please start it by saying We the People. We will take it over there for you. Also, check out the We the People website and the We the People Facebook group. Both links are in the description box below this video. Y'all, I believe help is on the way uh, for the people with Social Security, and I'm going to break down all of this in this video. So please stay tuned. Uh, Y'all know Joe Manchin, Christian Cinema, and AOC has never been any of my favorite people. In fact, I don't care for them a bit. But a lot of people are coming down on them hard right now for holding up the reconciliation bill. And yes, I have also. But now I see why they're doing this. And y'all, this can help the people that needs this help the most. But it will be in the second Re Reconciliation Act they are talking about having right now. Nothing is in stone yet, but... I really believe there will be a second reconciliation bill and a lot of them are pushing for it and of course you know the Democrats are in charge of the House the Senate and the White House so they can have a reconciliation bill if they so choose and a lot of them are choosing but just take this one thing that we did not get in this bill that they're working on now just take this one thing in consideration. We did not get full Medicare reform like they was pushing for. We did not get it. We only got one item out of the three. But both sides wants full Medicare reconciliation. I mean reform, I'm sorry. Misspoke there. But both sides wants this. So I really believe we will end up getting it in the second reconciliation bill all of these things could be all these things that we didn't get could be put in the second reconciliation bill since both sides wants this it could actually come about as being a bipartisan bill a standalone bill uh, and then they could save that reconciliation for a little bit further down the road and we will end up getting even more help. So it is looking good that we will get these things. Y'all, I have been seeing in my comments uh, things like no stimulus check, no help for seniors, so we get nothing, so no Christmas. Y'all, it seems like people are giving up. That's the wrong thing to do. Do not give up. If you give up, that means you're giving in to what they want. It's not about what they want. It's about what the American people needs. If you give up, you lose the fight. Now, I agree with the stimulus check. A lot of people does need that. I agree with the uh, help for the seniors. A lot of seniors needs this. So we get nothing? No, we're going to get something. No Christmas? For the people that's waiting on a stimulus check just for Christmas, you need to re-examine what Christmas is all about. It's not about gifts. Our Christmas gift is waiting for us in heaven. I do understand your disappointment and your frustrations. But I do believe that the Second Reconciliation Act, or even a standalone bill, We'll, we will be getting the help that we need. I say we. To be honest with you, I don't need the help. 
but there's millions and millions of people out there that does need the help. And I really believe that you will be getting your help. <clears throat> now I get it. You should have been first in line. I get that and I agree with you and I agree with you 100%. You should have been first in line. But unfortunately, our government did not see, the, see it that way. But I will have to ask you one thing to remember with your frustrations. A YouTuber is just here to break down what's happening. A YouTuber cannot do anything. So please don't kill the messenger when you don't hear what you want to hear. I may not tell you what you want to hear, but I will always tell you what you need to hear. I can promise you that. But there is three things that you can do to help this along, to get the help that we need. Those three things are the midterm elections. Vote these people out of office. Don't give them a free slip. I mean, a lot of this is our own fault for keep voting the same crooked politicians back into office. A lot of it is on us. And yes, I take the blame for that also. The second thing you could do is in the 2024 elections, vote these crooked politicians out of office. The third thing you can do, a lot of people will not do it. They say it won't help. Make those phone calls, write those letters. All the phone numbers and the addresses that you need is in my description box below. Get them and use them. Let your voices be heard. Okay, moving on. More mandates from Joe Biden. Y'all know he was... He's setting a mandate for large companies. They would have to make their employee, employees get the jab in the arm or they would lose their job or the company would be fined real heavily for each employee. Well, now Joe Biden is working up a plan to include all companies to do the same thing, no matter the size. So if you work, you will get poked or you'll get fired. This will put a lot more people out of a job, creating more unemployment created by Joe Biden. It will put more companies out of business and create more unemployment. This is created by Joe Biden also. Joe Biden is destroying our country and I do not comply. I will not fall for their mandates. This little dictator that we have in the White House, he will not stop until he controls your every move. Y'all, we all need to take a hard stand against our United States government now before it's too late. Once they pass all of these laws and bills, it's too late. We can't do nothing. Now's the time to act. Right now, I don't really see very many people standing up. For the most part, most people are just sitting back, taking it up the old bungholio. Again, I want to say thank you so much for all the support that you give me on this channel, allowing me to do this. Thank you so much. Now, for what I see in the second reconciliation bill that will be passed closer to the midterms, I mean, the second reconciliation package is not set in stone yet. They're just talking about it. And I really believe that it will happen. But in that, we could see a four stimulus check. Who will get it? I could almost guarantee low or no income people, people on SSI, SSDI, Social Security, VA, that kind of that kind of stuff. Those people would definitely be getting this check if it happens. 
How much will it be? There's no way of knowing that. It could be anywhere from $100 to $2,000. If any YouTuber ever gives you a set amount, they're lying to you because there's no way to know. And in fact, this, this stimulus check is not even in writing yet. They're not even really talking about it. This is just opinions. So if somebody gives you a, a dollar amount, click off their channel. A raise for Social Security, SSI, SSDI, and VA. Like Joe Biden promised. He promised all throughout his campaign a $200 raise for these people. Y'all, I am sorry to say, I think that was just a campaign lie. I don't see it happening, but I do pray that I'm wrong on this. This is one thing I would love to be wrong on. Medicare reform. I think this will be in the reconciliation bill. Because we did not get the things that we want. Uh, we only got one item. Both sides wants it. So I believe we will see Medicare reform again. On these three things... I do see them in the second reconciliation bill. And if you disagree with me, that's fine. We all have opinions. I am no different from you. I am just another YouTuber. And on that point, I want to say, I've been getting a lot of comments, people in my uh, comment section saying that I should not give my opinion. I should stick to reporting the news. Y'all, I'm going to explain this again. This is my channel, so whose opinion would I give? Uh, if you want your opinion heard, put it in my comment section. Uh, people will see it. Or start your own YouTube channel and give your opinion. Y'all, I don't pretend to be a news reporter here. God knows there's enough YouTubers acting like they're news reporters. When they're not, they're just YouTube YouTubers. I am not pretending to be a, uh, a news reporter. I am just a YouTuber just I'm, I'm a person just like you and I have an opinion and I have a YouTube channel so I put my opinion here I can't put anybody else's opinion here but if you want your opinion heard make those phone calls write those letters exercise your right to vote put your comments in my comment section y'all I love you all Keep your faith in Jesus Christ. He will get us through this. Say a prayer for our world. Say a prayer for our country. Say a prayer for our leaders. Even though they're not leading, prayer can and will turn that around. Say a prayer for everyone around the world that's hurting through COVID, financial hardship, or any other affliction. And just know I love you all. Until next time, ciao.